Hi folks, let's talk sports. I'm Josh Shacks. You know, with the state record six straight championships, arguably the best high school coach in the state, an Ole Miss commit that scored 40 touchdowns a season ago at tailback and a 90 plus tackles, nine sacks recording defensive lineman. Well, Jackson Prep is primed to continue its football dynasty going for their seventh straight championship. You got an opportunity to put this thing at seven. Have you had time to kind of like just sit down and just put that like into perspective there? You guys are setting the bar. Whether well, MAIS, MHSAA, nobody's ever won six in a row. You got an opportunity to go for seven now. Seven. <laughs> <laughs> like LeBron, huh? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that, that's that's a ring for about just about every finger. Every finger, yeah. So, I mean, yeah. I mean, it's gonna be it's gonna be an exciting one. This is gonna be an, an adventure this season. I mean, go want to find our identity, like I said before. I mean, once we find our identity, we're gonna be we're ready to play some ball. Yeah. I think we tried that once not to talk about it. That didn't help any. So okay. since then, we've just said, like, let's just talk about it. Let's sell it like it is and just play it from there. Ninety-two tackles last year, nine sacks. Uh, and the defense, I was looking at another stat, too. All year long, you gave up uh, an average of 9.6, just 9.6 points a game. Uh, this year, what can we expect, man? Smash mouth football with Coach Burr. I, I mean, like it. He's got us fired up every game. We're going to fly the football. No matter where it is. Yeah, he likes that number 10, so he can look like he's making a lot of production with that number 10. <laughs> he likes that, that defensive 10. And he'll see some, he'll see a little action on offense this year, too. So he's going to be a little bit more uh, involved this year in the whole team effort. And I just want to be, the, be a great team leader. That's my only goal I have this year. I want to be able to carry my team when they need me the most. I have to be more vocal than I have been in the past. And, uh, Something I'm how they gonna work on. The thing about him, he presses everybody else to play hard too. Now he his practice habits and the way he practices, and everybody else tries to, to follow his lead. So he has been a leader so far, and he'll be a great leader this year. I mean, well, you never get to play high school football again, and mm -hmm. just want to leave with a legacy and be able to tell your kids and grandkids later on in the future that you played for the greatest team in Mississippi. I feel real good about what our players do. What our players have been able to do for years is just rise to the occasion. Mm -hmm. And that's what we want to make sure this team can do. Yeah, and folks, uh, just in case you were wondering, they are favored to win it all again this season.